So, so food equals energy, right? But seems when we talk about energy, well, is nuclear energy, solar, wind, fossil fuels, gas, you name it, right? And seems that everybody is only interested in those sources of energy. If you control where the energy comes from, you'll be the one in power. And seems that we forget food. We forget that if my car doesn't work because I have no gas on the tank, I could walk to my work. It will take me longer, but I can walk. What we forget is that the most important source of energy on this planet is food. I'm really mainly interested in how we use science to feed humanity, especially those that have no food. That's when science to me really is relevant, more than ever before, and can answer many of the problems we face. The future of meat, I think, can be written in any way we care to. We can put a man on the moon. We can recreate beef in a lab. We've already done so. And I think so much of the cult of, of, of meat consumption in this country uh, it is already so divorced from the source of that product to begin with, whether it comes from a styrofoam package or from a lab, I'm not sure we'd ever know the difference. If we use science in the right way, we can feed the planet. But I want to make sure that then we don't use that science for few companies take advantage of that power. And, and we need to be careful with that. One of the other great advances that we are going to see uh, is our ability uh, to farm within the oceans. There is an amazingly untapped potential to create delicious, nutritious, uh, affordable food from the oceans in ways that are not only sustainable to the environments, but in some ways are actually restorative of ecosystems. Food is what moves you and me forward. Without food, we are nothing. And we have to remember that. Bruyette Severan, in 1826, wrote, tell me what you eat and I will tell you who you are. But also he had a more powerful phrase. He said, the destiny of the nations will depend on how they feed themselves. That's a powerful phrase. And what he meant was, that's the energy that will move every one of us. And so we will move the planet forward. Without food, we are nothing. We cannot forget about that.